interview I am. Like I said, I'm going to apologize for my attire. Um, I didn't expect it to be this cold. And I couldn't find my black jacket. So, yeah. But I have to go in here at 10. And then, um, so basically today, um, I've already had the interview, initial interview. And so, today is kind of the... I'm not gonna tell y'all where, of course, but today, y'all, when I say this place is literally like a good, maybe like a five minute, like three to five minute, um, she might be here for the thing too, three to five minute drive from my dad's house. So if I'm working like a Monday, I can just come over on Sunday and then boom. But today, I've already had the interview. Um, it's like, I guess, a two step process. So I had the interview and then I probably should go ahead and go in. I had the interview, and then I had the, today we're having like the second one, just like an in-person. The first one was on, over the phone, because coming in at a certain time, I was just like, nah. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to check out what's going on here. But yeah, I'm about to go in, because it is 10 o'clock, and my whole thing is I wanted to get in and out, so I can come straight home. Like I said, I hope my attire isn't bad, and yes. It's like a, a time frame between 10 and 10.30. I just said that I would come at... Yeah, she just left the, oh, the window open to 10 and 10.30. Well, I'm going to go ahead and go in because I'm the kind of person where I just want to get stuff done. Um, yeah. I've been trying to take up all the job opportunities that I can. But yes, there will be some job opportunities that I just won't take because it's not even worth it. But they do pay a little more than my current job. So this one, um, hopefully they can get me working three days a week. My whole thing with a job is that I need to know that I'm guaranteed hours. Like, that's my whole thing. So if I can't be guaranteed hours, it's kind of pointless, you know, for a job. Because, you know, like, we need money. We need, yeah, a lot of these places like Amazon and... Uh, we have some places that are affiliated with Amazon. I want to give them time to come out because I don't know if. Be like a lot of these places are affiliated with Amazon, so I'm kind of like, why is he driving so fast? Yeah, a lot of most of these places, which is good that they're being affiliated with Amazon, because Amazon pays 17 an hour. I think when you go to these places, they're paying about 15 and up. So yes, if you can get into a job affiliated with Amazon that's not working in an Amazon warehouse. Good deal. But I am going. To go in here, see what you know everything is. I'll catch y'all guys later. I don't know how much of that y'all got, but when she said what she was gonna start me, I said, huh? I said, what? Oh yeah, let me let me let me go ahead and slice so my hat back there. Let me go ahead and can I turn right here? Nope. Great. So now I gotta figure out. Dang, I couldn't. Can I turn right here? I need to know if I can, because if I can't, then be, I gotta, I think we good. I think they just back there, but I make a new turn, so. <sighs> Let me get some light. I ain't gonna, I'm gonna light it. But yeah, I think it went pretty good. So, the way it's gonna go is I'm gonna be on call. So if they need me, like I said, my availability was like for like six hours. Only because with the job that I'm at now, I work on Fridays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. So um, I literally have days that I can come in. So I was just like, just put me on the days that I'm not working there and my other jobs. And then boom. So as a when I don't when I get her thing, then possibly I have like three jobs. Um, but yeah, just so that we're making it clear. I work Tuesday oh, that is bright. I work Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. Those are the three days that I work. I would rather work a Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, 
and like just leave Fridays to me. Um, but yeah, I put my like when to end for the day at four, only because I have to go home and do homework. And if y'all know my school, my class, we have to be. I should just get up one more time. We gotta be done with. Ooh, slow down, please. We have to be done with our work by eight o'clock. So if I'm doing something, if I'm working and I don't get up to like six, seven, but well that defeats the whole purpose of like me having time to do whatever. So this is honestly just like a little ride along with me just to kind of show y'all what I do on these types of days. I honestly just be, I don't be doing nothing, but I got to get over. I don't be doing nothing. I'm going to show you my personality. Why is this car speeding? I don't know. Charlotte people. Let me just, let me just say something about these Charlotte people. Go ahead, car, because I don't want you behind me. Charlotte people just can't drive. Simply put it like that. They can't drive. Yes, I'm one of them. I sometimes can't drive either, but majority of the time, I can drive better than anybody. Like, I get told I can't drive, but who y'all be wanting to drive y'all around places? Me. Everybody want me to drive them around, but you say I can't drive. What sense does that make? I'm trying to think, do I need anything? Like, do I need to do anything? they put some new bricks for so one thing let me get y'all a little driving lessons this is gonna be the most boring vlog ever and that's gonna be the name of the title because what why why do people press like this right here why the freak oh my gosh the light is the, the light is green i would get over if i knew this car wasn't going at a certain speed be like yeah, the light be green and we still be going like we still be stopped or it could be a car a whole mile ahead of them and then they press it on their brakes like we finna pass this forward why was they stopping then you got people that don't know where they going just like me i um i had my gps on but like i knew where i was going but like, i knew I had my GPS on, but I knew of the area, so I knew where to turn, what street, all that kind of stuff. But if you in Charlotte and you know your exit is coming up, why are you all the way in the right in the left lane? You all the way in the left lane, but your exit is right here. I don't have like bad road rage. My mom has. Ooh, I don't know if over the years it done got worse. But I just know for me, living in Charlotte, and the more people come, the more traffic that there is, I feel as if moving to a bigger city with, not not even a bigger city, moving to another city with more people, like Atlanta. I do want to move to Atlanta. That is, honestly, that is a goal of mine. Um... Yeah, it's one of a goal of mine. Like, if it doesn't happen, it's not going to, like, really hurt me or affect me. I just want business in Atlanta. I want to, not even business. Yeah, business, but I want to travel to Atlanta to where it feels as if I live there. Like, I want, just, I want, for as another city, I want Atlanta to be my home city unless I travel somewhere else and I feel like that's my home I really want to go to Houston I just hear so much about Houston they say everything is bigger in Texas and I really need to see that I'm trying to think what other I don't really want to care I don't care for Chicago I mean of course you hear bad things about everywhere but Chicago is just I mean I do want to go but I just I feel like that's not going to be like a home for me like, I like, couldn't live in New York, don't even bring that up, 
could live in New York. New York is just, New York is a travel city. New York is literally a travel city, a tourist city, however you say it. That's what New York is. New York, for me, is nowhere to live. It's nowhere to live. I just want to come in here though. Just tell y'all. I paid the interview. It wasn't really it, it was an interview, but it wasn't an interview. I had my interview and then I went in just to basically get my availability and to see when I can start and all that kind of stuff. But as of right now, Mondays and Wednesdays are like my real open days to where I'm able to do whatever. But I put Friday in there because if y'all don't need me on a day, I mean, if they would need me, I would go work there before Panera. So I would just call and be like, hey, my other job needs me. There will be some Fridays. If they don't call me on a Monday or a Wednesday, I'll come in here. I, it's it's all about compromising, and I'm big on compromising. I like to I like to be flexible. So if a Monday or a Wednesday, if they don't need me, I can like just chill at home, do my videos. Y'all, I was able. Are y'all proud of me? Like I was able to get two videos. Y'all only have 13 subscribers, but I'm gonna talk to y'all like y'all are a hundred thousand, a million, whatever. But yeah, I put up two videos yesterday. It was oh my gosh, I was on call with the Apple support for a good maybe. For about, I mean, not long, like 45 minutes. I'm thinking about getting darker tint on these windows. Either way, you gotta pay. I'm gonna have to pay $10 extra, anyways, when I get my car inspected, so that's nothing. So, or either, I don't know how much it is. I don't know if it's 10 a window or what, but I, just, I want darker windows, so I don't feel like someone's staring at me when I'm driving. Um, yes. I really just forgot what I was thinking, talking about. So I'm just gonna go home and oh yeah, I was talking about videos. So I uploaded two videos yesterday, but I was on Apple support call for about 30 minutes, just trying to figure out why is it whatever, whatever. So I had to lock out of my Apple ID, uh, locking out of my Apple ID, of course, to come out making another emoji or whatever for my character, but. I don't need to like really doing that. But other than that, I'm not gonna say it worked. I guess it worked. I don't know. I guess we'll just time will tell because it's been happening ever since I started using iMovie. This isn't nothing new. But ever since I started using iMovie, that's when it just started messing up. I'm so sorry that this vlog is probably gonna be in a upright angle. Because I forgot to do it the other way. And I've been talking already for 10 minutes. So y'all just gonna have to get it the way y'all get it. I'm gonna catch y'all though when I get home. So I can listen to my music. But when I get my second phone. Well no, because we still gonna get copyrighted. I had to take out some of my music for my contact video. If y'all do remember. I had to take out some of my music. And yeah, that was kind of sad, but we're just gonna work with it. But I'm gonna get y'all in the next clip.